Have you ever stopped to wonder about the incredible complexity of the human eye? This small organ, barely two inches in diameter, holds a universe of intricate design and remarkable functionality. It's a marvel of evolution, a testament to nature's ingenuity, and the key to our perception of the world around us. The human eye is a marvel of complexity. It is composed of over two million working parts, making it second only to the brain in terms of complexity. This intricate organ is responsible for our ability to perceive light, discern colors, and detect movement. It does all this while continuously adjusting to changes in light, focus, and visual field, making it one of the most dynamic organs in our body. But the human eye is more than just a biological camera. It is a window into our health, revealing signs of systemic diseases such as diabetes and hypertension long before other symptoms manifest. It is also a window into our emotions, expressing joy, sorrow, surprise, and a myriad of other sentiments without uttering a single word. And yet, despite its importance and complexity, the eye is often taken for granted. We seldom stop to appreciate its wonders or ponder on the journey of eye care, which has evolved over centuries from primitive eyeglasses to sophisticated contact lenses and groundbreaking surgical procedures. This video is a tribute to the human eye, a celebration of its wonders and an exploration of the fascinating world of eye care. We will delve into the anatomy of the eye, understanding how it works to give us vision. We will journey through the history of eyeglasses, tracing their evolution from simple reading aids to modern fashion accessories. We will discuss common eye disorders and their treatments and look forward to the future of eye care with advances in surgical procedures and potential innovations on the horizon. So let's dive into the wonderful world of the human eye and its evolution. The human eye, a complex organ, is composed of multiple parts, each playing a crucial role in our ability to see. Let's embark on an intriguing exploration of these components. Firstly, we have the cornea, the transparent outer layer of the eye. Acting much like a window, the cornea controls and focuses the entry of light into the eye. Next in line is the lens, located right behind the iris and the pupil. This clear, flexible structure functions like a camera lens, focusing light onto the retina for clear vision. It adjusts its shape for objects at varying distances, an action we call accommodation. Speaking of the retina, it's a thin layer of tissue lining the back of the eye. It's here that light focused by the cornea and lens gets converted into electrical signals. These signals are then sent to the brain through the optic nerve, creating the images we perceive. The iris, the colored part of the eye, regulates the amount of light entering the eye by adjusting the size of the pupil, its central opening. In low light conditions, the iris widens the pupil to let in more light, while in bright light, it constricts the pupil to reduce light entry. Lastly, we have the optic nerve, the visual messenger to the brain. It carries the electrical signals from the retina to the brain, where they are interpreted as the images we see. Each of these components plays a vital role in the process of vision. The cornea and lens work together to focus light. The retina converts this light into signals. The optic nerve transports these signals to the brain. And the iris regulates the amount of light entering the eye. It's a marvel how these different parts, each with its unique function, work in harmony to give us our sense of sight. Without even one of these elements, our vision would be compromised. Each part of the eye works together seamlessly, allowing us to perceive and interpret the world around us. But how does this intricate organ translate light into the images we see? The process of vision, while seemingly instantaneous, is a fascinating sequence of events that begins the moment light enters our eyes. Firstly, light passes through the cornea, the eye's clear dome-shaped surface. This is where the bulk of the eye's focusing power resides. The cornea bends or refracts the light, directing it toward the lens. The lens, a clear structure located behind the iris and the pupil, further refines this light to make a sharp image. Now the light reaches the retina, a thin layer of tissue at the back of the eye lined with millions of photoreceptor cells. These cells, known as rods and cones, are responsible for detecting light and color. Rods excel in low light and allow for night vision, while cones function best in bright light and are sensitive to color. When the light strikes these cells, a remarkable transformation occurs. The energy of the light triggers a cascade of chemical and electrical events, creating neural signals. These signals are then transmitted through a complex network of cells in the retina until they converge on the optic nerve, a bundle of over one million nerve fibers. 
the optic nerve acts as a high-speed biological cable, carrying the signals from the eye to the brain. This is where the final and perhaps most astonishing step of the vision process happens. The brain receives these signals and translates them into images, completing the process of vision. But the wonder doesn't stop there. Our eyes are constantly adjusting and adapting. They change the size of the pupil to control the amount of light that enters the eye. They also adjust the shape of the lens to keep objects in focus, whether they are near or far. Thus, our eyes, the windows to the world, enable us to perceive and interact with our surroundings. That's the magic of vision, an intricate dance of light, cells, and neurons all working together to create the vivid panorama of life as we see it. As fascinating as the human eye is, it's not without its flaws. Over the centuries, we have developed tools to help correct these imperfections. The most common of these tools is the eyeglasses, a simple yet revolutionary invention that has greatly improved our ability to see and experience the world. The story of eyeglasses begins in Italy, around the 13th century. The earliest models were essentially reading stones, convex pieces of glass that magnified text for those with hyperopia or farsightedness. These primitive eyeglasses were held directly over the material to be read, a far cry from the wearable designs we're familiar with today. The 16th century marked a significant leap forward in eyeglasses design. Italian maestro Salvino d'Armate is often credited with inventing wearable eyeglasses. His design, which included frames that balanced on the bridge of the nose, allowed people with vision problems to engage in daily activities with ease. The next few centuries saw a flurry of innovations. The invention of bifocals by Benjamin Franklin in the mid-18th century was a game-changer. These allowed for the correction of both nearsightedness and farsightedness in a single pair of glasses. By the 19th century, eyeglasses were becoming more than just vision correction tools. They were fashion statements. With the Industrial Revolution, mass production became possible, and eyeglasses were made in a wide variety of styles and materials. The advent of plastic in the 20th century further diversified the options available to consumers. In the late 20th and early 21st centuries, eyeglasses have continued to evolve. Today we have lenses that can adjust their focus, glasses that can darken in sunlight, and even smart glasses that can display information from our smartphones. From humble beginnings as reading stones to the sophisticated designs of the modern era, eyeglasses have come a long way. They have not only corrected our vision but also shaped our culture and fashion. Eyeglasses, a simple yet revolutionary invention, have greatly improved our ability to see and experience the world. As technology progressed, so did our ability to correct vision. The story of eyewear in the modern era is one of unceasing evolution and innovation, driven by a desire to enhance visual acuity and comfort for all. Eyeglasses, once a simple tool for vision correction, have evolved into a multifaceted accessory that combines style, function, and cutting-edge technology. The use of lightweight materials like plastic and polycarbonate has made glasses not only more durable but also more comfortable to wear. Advances in lens technology have given us thinner and lighter lenses, even for strong prescriptions, making glasses less obtrusive and more aesthetically pleasing. In addition to this, the invention of progressive lenses has made it possible to correct multiple vision issues with a single pair of glasses. These lenses provide a seamless progression of many lens powers for all viewing distances. With a simple glance upwards, downwards, or straight ahead, the wearer can focus easily, whether they're reading, looking at something in the middle distance, or viewing something far away. On the other hand, contact lenses, which started as hard, uncomfortable pieces of glass, have transformed into soft, breathable devices that are nearly undetectable to the wearer. Materials like silicone hydrogel allow oxygen to pass through the lens to the cornea, making them safer and more comfortable for long-term wear. Furthermore, the introduction of disposable contact lenses has made maintaining eye hygiene easier than ever. Moreover, the realm of contact lenses has expanded beyond mere vision correction. There are lenses designed to reshape your cornea as you sleep, correcting myopia temporarily, and there are even lenses that can slow the progression of myopia in children. Not to mention colored and costume lenses allow wearers to change their eye color or create unique looks. These modern solutions have made vision correction more comfortable and accessible than ever before. The continuous advancements in eyewear and contact lenses promise a future where perfect vision is within everyone's reach. However, not all vision problems can be solved with glasses or contacts. 
there exist a variety of common eye disorders that require more specialized treatment. Let's delve into some of these conditions, shall we? First up is myopia or nearsightedness, where distant objects appear blurry. This typically results from the eyeball being too long or the cornea being too curved. Treatments range from corrective lenses to refractive surgery like LASIK. Next is hyperopia or farsightedness. In this case, the eyeball is too short or the cornea is too flat. Close objects appear blurry, while distant objects can be seen more clearly. Like myopia, hyperopia can be corrected with glasses, contacts, or surgery. Moving on, we have astigmatism, a condition where the cornea or lens is not perfectly round, causing blurry or distorted vision. This can be corrected with special lenses or refractive surgery. Then there's presbyopia, an age-related condition where the eye loses its ability to focus on close objects. Reading glasses or multifocal lenses are common solutions, though surgical options like lens implants are also available. Lastly, let's talk about cataracts, a clouding of the eye's lens that can cause blurry vision and glare. Cataracts are primarily treated through surgery where the cloudy lens is replaced with an artificial one. These are just a few of the many eye disorders that people may encounter. Each one presents its own unique challenges and requires a different approach to treatment. From glasses and contacts to surgeries and implants, the methods we use to correct these conditions are as diverse as the conditions themselves. It's important to note that early detection and treatment are key in managing these disorders. Regular eye checkups can help identify issues before they become serious and can keep your vision sharp and clear. While these disorders pose challenges, advancements in medicine have provided us with effective ways to manage them. When non-surgical treatments are not enough, we turn to the cutting-edge field of eye surgery. Let's delve into the world of surgical procedures and the future innovations that promise to revolutionize eye care. First off, there's LASIK, or Laser-Assisted in Situ Keratomalusis. This procedure reshapes the cornea to allow for proper light focusing onto the retina. It's a popular choice for correcting myopia, hyperopia, and astigmatism. Then there's photorefractive keratectomy, or PRK. Similar to LASIK, PRK also reshapes the cornea, but it does so by removing a thin layer of corneal tissue. PRK is often chosen when the patient's cornea might be too thin for LASIK. For those suffering from cataracts, a common procedure is cataract surgery, where the cloudy lens is replaced with an artificial one. This surgery has been a game changer, restoring sight to millions worldwide. As we look to the horizon, the future of eye surgery is filled with promise. A new generation of intraocular lenses is in development, aiming to provide even better vision quality and greater freedom from glasses. On the frontier of scientific research, we find the fascinating realm of gene therapy. Scientists are exploring ways to deliver healthy genes into our cells to replace faulty ones that cause genetic eye disorders. While still in its early stages, gene therapy holds tremendous potential for curing inherited eye conditions. Another promising avenue is the field of regenerative medicine. Researchers are investigating the use of stem cells to regenerate damaged parts of the eye, such as the cornea or the retina. This could potentially restore vision in individuals who have suffered irreversible damage to their eyes. And we can't forget about the role of artificial intelligence. AI is being utilized to create predictive models for eye diseases, potentially revolutionizing early detection and treatment strategies. With continuous advancements in technology and medicine, the future of eye care looks bright indeed. The human eye, a marvel of evolution, continues to inspire and challenge us. Its intricate anatomy, from the cornea to the optic nerve, is a testament to the wonders of nature. And yet our understanding and ability to care for this vital organ has grown exponentially over the centuries. We've journeyed from the rudimentary eyeglasses of yesteryears, developed for hyperopia and later for myopia, to the innovative designs and materials of modern eyewear and contact lenses. These advancements have not only improved vision correction but also comfort and style, making eyeglasses and contact lenses more than just medical aids, but fashion statements too. We've delved into the common eye disorders that affect millions worldwide. Myopia, hyperopia, astigmatism, presbyopia, and cataracts. We've learned about their non-surgical treatments from corrective lenses to lifestyle changes and how they can help maintain and improve our vision. In the realm of surgical procedures, we've explored LASIK, PRK, cataract surgery, and other treatments, marveling at the technological advancements that have made these procedures safer and more effective. 
and the future holds even more promise as researchers continue to innovate and push the boundaries of what's possible in eye care. Remember, the eyes are not just the windows to the soul, but also the windows to the world around us. They allow us to perceive colors, shapes, and movements, to read, to recognize faces, to appreciate art, and to navigate our environment. As Helen Keller once said, the only thing worse than being blind is having sight but no vision. And Henry David Thoreau reminds us that the eye is the jewel of the body. So let's cherish and take care of our eyes and continue to marvel at the wonders of human vision. For more fascinating journeys into the wonders of the human body, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to our channel. So the next time you marvel at a beautiful sight, remember the incredible journey of the human eye and the advancements in eye care that help us enjoy this world in all its visual splendor.